So I got this package in the mail a couple weeks ago and I want to show you me building it. So let's open it. Ooh. All right, so first off we got this a little guide. And then I believe this is the main part. Ooh. So that's the body of the guitar. And then this is called the headstock or the neck. It's both, I believe. Yeah, so this is where all the string work comes in. So go over here. And then this part of the box, this has the strings. So these. Um, an amplifier cord. These, um, I don't actually know what these are called, but these connect the strings to the rest of the guitar. This also goes with that. And then you got uh, electric stuff, you know, so that way it can work correctly. I don't know what this is. Then you got, oh, oh. all right. Look at this. That is shiny. That is nice. All right, so you got those, two of those. Um, I believe this is where the sound is transferred. And then uh, you got screws, bolts, nuts, uh, uh, the tuning parts, and the actual uh, pick guard. So this keeps the pick from damaging the actual guitar. And so I'm gonna take all this stuff out. Put that over there. All right, where did I put the manual? All right, so it's right over here. All right, so it's got, you know, instructions, it's got a Manual shows all the little pieces, and it says I should do the tuners first, so I'm gonna get started on that. All right, Let that come out. All right, the guitar neck is done. All of these are on correctly, I believe. So that means, yep, they're all tight. They all won't budge. So that means the strings can go in them and not worry about, I don't know, cutting someone's eye out. So I believe next is the electric work on the body. So I'm gonna show you that right now. Yeah. This is very terrible material. All right, body, final thing. Ooh, this is a very nice color. All 
right. So this is the front, actually, I think. Wait, no, this is the front. And then this is the back. This is where the um, electricity for the, uh, the, I don't know what it's called, but it's where the wire plugs in and connects it to the amp. And then these four spots are for the tone and rhythm parts. So these, these will have little tuners that will pretty much change the sound of the guitar. This is where the um, metal parts go that pick up the sound. I think this is a bigger piece. And then this is right where the headstock goes. So right there. All right, now I'm going to get started. All right, so now that the neck is attached, uh, kinda, it's still kind of loose around the back, but I think I'm gonna have to get a power screwdriver or whatever those are called to finish the screwing them in because it's hardwood, so it's kind of hard to uh, drill into that. And then next, is the electricity, the wiring. All right, so this is actually uh, made out to be pretty easy. So I'm hoping it actually is. So the pickups are pre-assembled on the pick guard and simply need to be connected to the control cover. That's what it says here in the manual. So I gotta be really careful with these. All right, so these are all connected. So, all right, so we got tone, tone. All right, it looks like the, well, there's some weird wire colors. All right, now that we've got, I think, all the electrical stuff done, um, along with these knobs, which are the uh, volume and tone buttons. So, I'm going to be doing the strings now. So, they are right here. You gotta be very careful with these, though. These are very uh, sharp at least some of the strings. You can poke your eye out very, 
very dangerous. So, put these through there. All right. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So now for six strings. Gotta be very, very careful. All right, the strings are Free. Right after this, actually. Oh, oh, all right. The strings are free. So you usually want to start off with the largest string, the E, the E2, as some people like to call it. So these things on the back are so that when it goes through here, the entire string doesn't go through. All right, now that the strings are done, um, they are actually done. You have to cut them um, just so if someone is using a larger guitar neck, um, they'll be able to have that extra room. So I'm gonna wait to cut these uh, just in case, but I'm going to tune this and test it out. All right, so I've got the fully tuned guitar here now, and I'm gonna test it out all tuned and plugged into the amp.